Hello, I'm Giovanna Lewis and I'm part of the Keep Portland Hospital campaign. We're here at Portland Hospital this morning for Hands Around the Hospital. This is um, a show from the public, a demonstration to the Trust and the CCG, reinforcing the fact that we want to keep this hospital, we want to keep it today and for the future, for our children in the future. All NHS hospitals and services are vital to the community, not just on Portland, but Weymouth and Wyoming to Dorset too. We're hoping lots of people will come and help us give a strong message that this hospital is important and it needs to be kept for all of us. And who knows, one day we might even get our beds back too. And now I'm going to introduce Lynn Hubbard, who's an NHS worker and has vast experience of defending the NHS, looking after our NHS in the interest of all of us. And you'll have been told some horror stories. 
what it means when you can't get treatment because you can't afford it. We don't want to privatise the NHS. We want a Portland hospital. We want a Wareham community hospital. We want St Leonard's. We want all these community hospitals. They're ours. They're not for sale. And we need to send that message. This report, which many of you won't have even seen, it was meant to be a consultation, is cutting Dorset NHS by £156 million. Pounds. Right? You can't do that without a price for people's lives. People like Debbie Montau have campaigned tirelessly in Swanage to stop the, the closure of Paul Accident Emergency, to stop the closure of their community hospitals. There's many people doing very, very good work all over Dorset because our NHS matters. We would say to this government, to lovely Theresa May, we've got the money. We don't need to make the cuts. It's our NHS. Who's NHS?